I really, really, really didn't expect Asti, the video, I, the first video I posted, to get that many views that fast and for people to know about it and share it and everyone was so positive and it felt so good and I was so happy because I honestly wasn't expecting that and I really wanted to make it like the main low key thing and then watch Himatri, I'll start telling people type of thing but then everyone found out and everyone started watching it and it was just so overwhelming for me but it was so nice and I was so excited and like I still can't believe this is happening but I'm super excited and I'm starting off the series with Mirror first DIY which is a DIY phone case which was super easy but then my voiceovers are ikdumay awkward because I didn't know how to not be awkward and then like middle whatever accent fluctuates and it's just a little very awkward because I'm awkward and this is turning out to be awkward it's not what I wanted I hope you like I hope you like it please share like <laughs> So the things that you'll need are an old or new phone case, any color of nail polish of your choice if you're not happy with the color of your phone case, and a clear top coat, a pair of scissors, and two or three CDs. I just took a few out of some old useless DVDs. Then you go ahead and paint your phone case if you need to, but it doesn't need to be perfect because it's only for the base. So while the phone case dries, you can start working with the CD. So now we want to cut a chunk out of the CD so it makes it easier for us to separate the two layers. Cutting a chunk out makes it a lot easier to really separate the two layers of the CD. So all you need to do is wedge something sharp between the two layers of the CD and it'll just peel right apart. So then you cut the holographic part into different pieces and then make sure you cut the border and the inside circles to give it a more neater look. Then you cut your CD into tiny triangular pieces and begin placing and arranging it on your phone case to your liking and to please your aesthetic. Then if you still have gaps like I did, you can just cut the leftover shards and fill those in. Then it should look something like this. So once you're happy with the arrangement, you can start gluing it in. I would not re recommend Fevico because it's not that durable. I, I didn't have super glue, so I had to use Fevico, but use super glue instead. So the last step of this process is adding a layer of clear nail polish to really seal it in. And it also gives this really cool, more holographic sheen to it. And then your phone case is ready. I know it was kind of awkward and like I didn't do a very good job at explaining but it was super easy and it's super fun and I hope you liked it and I'm so excited to do more videos. Hi. Oh my god, I was still all hype and you were so awkward. I didn't think of something else. Hi. 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 <laughs> Bowie, stop! Grew up, a costo girl, and I'm not gonna speak in that bad. Hi, 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 hi. Yo, yo.